a cat, waited for a lady outside a building for days in the same position. He instantly transformed into a lap cat, a cat that had been abandoned outside of a building and sat frozen in fear in the same place for a few days, was reported to Megan from Puppy Kitty NYCity, a NYC-based animal rescue. When she got there, she saw the scared and worn-out tabby snuggled up against the wall. She walked carefully toward him, and he meowed timidly. Megan extended her hand to test his friendliness. He wanted to hiss at first, but as soon as he felt her touch on his back, the frown on his face changed into one of satisfaction. Even after lying on the ground, the tabby sprang up and asked for additional head scratching. I think he knew right away that he was safe. Megan carefully picked him up and carried him back to her vehicle in a makeshift carrier. The cat seemed to be prepared to leave the challenging street life as he remained peacefully in the bag the whole time. He instantly climbed into my lap and began headbutting everything since I didn't have a suitable carrier with me at the time because I was traveling home from work. The tabby kid ran to his savior while squealing with joy. He eventually placed his head on her lap after rubbing his face all over her. He didn't belong on the streets and needed a loving home, which was immediately apparent. Capone the cat had spent some of his nine lifetimes navigating the streets. When I initially came across him, he was a mess, matted, thin, and sporting some of the filthiest ears I had ever seen. He developed a serious crush on Megan and cuddled up to her the whole way home. Capone did not object when Megan shaved the tangles in his coat. He was so delighted to have someone tell him that he was secure that he would turn to mush any time he was touched. His eyes lost all trace of fright and were easily replaced. He made up for missed sleep that night, sleeping easily in a cozy bed with a full tummy. When Capone found himself back in his environment, he quickly became a huge cuddlebug. He loved being held in their arms and yearned for their attention. He started to gain weight and his coat returned to being lustrous and velvety with decent diet and plenty of love. He was the happiest kid in the world, sitting on a warm lap. He is the kindest and most devoted love bug ever. He liked lying on his owner's knee and watching bird TV while living inside. Since being rescued from the streets two months ago, he has not only grown into a soft teddy bear, but has also found the family of his dreams. Capone has the nicest new home and has been legally adopted. He has reached his joyful conclusion, Megan said. From the beginning, he was the finest. For him, we could not be happier.